talk a little bit about the weather here. New Year's Eve, a lot of folks have a lot of plans around here. It's, or it's cold, we can start saying that. Well, right, and people have been asking for cooler weather. We don't want the rain for New Year's no. Eve, and unfortunately, rain chances really are going up this weekend. All right, so let me show you the headlines. Our weather is changing, mostly sunny, though, and cool for Friday. I'm telling you, Friday, a nice day. High temperatures, upper 50s. But then your rain chances are going up Saturday into Monday. The good news is it's spread out, but the potential for three, four, five inches of rain. I think the heaviest rain southwest Mississippi into the North Shore and over the southwest corner of the state. We can look at this forecast model. We're looking at Saturday going into the evening hours, and it's showing the heaviest rain to the north. But here's the deal. If it just shifts a little bit more to the southeast, it could be an issue. Right now I'm going with the 60% chance of rain in the metro area and North Shore a 70% chance. That's for New Year's Eve evening right at the stroke of midnight. So here we are looking at a big picture of the rainfall forecast and once more southwest Louisiana into southwest Mississippi and it really expands. Here we are at midnight and it's showing rain for sure on the North Shore and then it spreads across all of southeast Louisiana. We're looking at what's happening now. We do have some high clouds. You know when you have clouds at night it tends not to be as cool but these are very thin clouds and those temperatures are going down because we've had this cold front move through big area of high pressure just to the north and we've got a pretty good north wind that's sending in that cooler drier air. We are watching those clouds to the west. A lot of this high level cloudiness and it is going to begin to move in tomorrow. Meanwhile this is a culprit. It's an upper level low that's moving on shore in California. That's what's going to pump all of the moisture our way and cause our rain chances to go up. So as we look at tomorrow some off and on clouds, but I really think a nice day with your highs in the upper 50s. The problem is this high is heading out really quickly, so we pick up that southerly flow with warm, moist air moving in. Then here comes that disturbance moving right in our direction. Southwest Mississippi into southwest Louisiana really looks like it could be heavy. This is midnight with much of that rain still to the north then it moves right over us. So once more, that potential that we could have locally heavy rain. As you go into the weekend, highs will climb into the 70s. But for New Year's Eve, I've got us in the upper 60s with about a 60 to 70 percent chance of rain. Maybe it will stay a little bit more to the north, but be aware of it because it eventually will spread across the area. The high today, 72, the average 62 degrees, and we were all pretty much in the 70s. That was at about 9 o'clock. The cold front then came through. The winds gusted to 36, 307 inch of rain at the lakefront, and then our temperatures dropped. Right now, low 40s to the low 50s, with your winds at times up to 25 miles per hour. That is the sustained wind. So as we look at tomorrow, it's good. We wish the whole weekend was good. Saturday, your rain chances go up. Sunday, rain is likely, especially in the morning. And unfortunately, we're going to continue with those rain chances for Monday as well. And then a weak front moves through and the weather improves for Tuesday and Wednesday.